to my channel so today's video is going to be a review of the hair that I've got here on my head that is from Aliexpress just to let you guys know quickly I didn't film an initial review of the hair like an, an unboxing first impression review just because I felt personally that when I get hair most hair come in good condition anyways so um, I've got clips of what the hair looked like in the beginning which I will show you guys anyways but um, that was why I didn't film an unboxing initial review I just said to myself that I was going to wear the hair for a while and um, then come to you guys with an initial review of how the hair has been behaving the hair is from Peerless Virgin Hair on Aliexpress and it is their Malaysian straight hair in the length 22, 22, 18, 16 and I think a 18 closure right here so yeah it's the Malaysian straight hair the hair came through DHL it took about three days to come as usual it came in the bright yellow packaging and then it came in the um, plastic see-through bags which had each length labeled on the bag as you probably see in the clip which I'm showing you right now the hair came in amazing condition it was extremely soft it had no smell whatsoever it didn't shed it didn't tangle this hair was so so beautiful um, I just wanted to say what I did notice when I did get the hair initially was that the wefts were single wefted it wasn't double wefted like a lot of wefts um, that I get so um, and the packs weren't that full so just to let you guys know the packs are a bit on the thin side regarding the weft it made it easier to sew because it was just single wefted but it wasn't as full as um, the normal packs which I deal with but um, I did get long length anyway so uh, the, long the longer the length the shorter the weft of hair so also what I noticed was that the closure was darker than the hair weft I felt like the closure was a bit more like just a bit darker it wasn't that that dark but it was dark enough for me to notice and that kind of bothered me so that was why I dyed the hair so the hair you see on my head right now is not in the natural color that the hair came in the natural color the hair came in is like in a 1b color is um, lighter than this hair I dyed the hair jet black I used like a jet black hair for the closure and then I used um kind of like a blue black dye for like the weft hair you can't really tell the difference anyways black is black <laughs> But yeah, that because of the color change, because of the color difference between the closure and the weft, I dyed the hair, and I'm so glad I did because I am feeling dark hair. Like jet black hair is the way to go. Like the difference between the black and your skin tone is just so nice, and it's just so it's just so different, and, and I really really like it. I'm so glad I dyed it. So, so since then, I have um, made the hair into a wig, and I've been wearing the wig for about three or four weeks now let's just say two three weeks actually and i've been wearing the wig for about two or three weeks now and i really really like this hair the hair is extremely extremely soft this hair is good straight silky hair if you're looking for good straight silky hair this is the hair it doesn't tangle whatsoever it's so silky it has a nice flow to it the hair has a nice body to it and um, even after dyeing it the hair took the black dye really really well it wasn't dry the ends are still really really healthy I'm really really happy the hair has is about like let's just say low to medium luster is not too too shiny I don't like my hair to be shiny anyways Um, regarding shedding when I was making the wig I kind of cut the weft as I was getting to the top because personally I like my hair to lay really really flat especially because I wanted it to be like that straight silky look so um, I cut the weft a bit so I think because of that the hair has been shedding just just a bit more than it should and I think that's because I cut the weft when you cut your weft your wefts are gonna shed somewhere so um, if you don't cut your weft I don't think you have a, any problem with shedding but my shedding was um, just a bit more than I, it should be but it wasn't anything that that serious and I kind of knew that was because um, that I had cut the weft. So regarding whether the hair can hold a curl or not, I haven't curled this hair so I can't tell you guys whether it can hold a curl or not but personally I don't think this hair would really hold a curl that well mainly because it's just so straight and nice and when I straighten it it stays bone straight like it doesn't have that slight wave to it whatever it just stays bone straight and hair that stay this straight and are in really good straight condition don't tend to hold a curl anyways I don't mind because I've got like wigs that I wear straight and I've got wigs that I wear when I want my hair to be curly, I'll put the curly wig on it instead. So, I've got like my straight wig and my curly wig. So, depending on how I feel, I would just pick a wig. So, I like the fact that it stays straight anyways. But if you're the kind of person that wants to wear your hair straight and curly, um, you need to have that in mind that this hair may not be able to hold a curl that well. So, body wave hair would be the choice to go for. But if you want that nice straight hair, 
um this is the hair to go because it just stays silky straight okay also yeah. i wanted to mention really quickly and um, my friend did buy hair from this vendor as well perilous version hair and she bought the exact same hair that i bought because i recommended the vendor to her and i wanted to tell you guys that her hair came in the exact same condition as my hair a lot of people think that youtubers get sent the best hair and some people have experience that they would buy hair that a youtuber recommended and it might not have came in the condition that they expected it to or the condition that the youtuber's hair came in so um just to let you guys know with this seller personally my friend bought the hair with her own money from aliexpress like a normal buyer and i was the one who who bleached her hair for her and dyed her hair for her and made her wig for her with the same hair she got the malaysian straight hair and the hair took bleach really really well and um, i bleached it to like a light color and then i put like a brown dye over it i'll try and insert a picture of what the hair looks like now and i just made it into a wig and she told me that she is in love with the hair she gets so many compliments she hasn't curled her hair either so i can't really tell you guys about the curling issue but she says her hair stays so straight People are asking her like what hair it is, what brand did you get the hair from. It doesn't look like AliExpress hair at all. Like it's really, really good quality and especially for the price that you pay for. It's really, really good. And um, the closure also is nice. The closure I got um, an 18 inches like I said. So it's really, really long. I wanted it to blend with the rest of hair nicely. I didn't want it to be like short, 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 short. I wanted it to just be sleeky and straight. Okay, so that was why I got 18 inches. Um, yeah, that's just the closure. Closure. So the closure doesn't tangle, it doesn't shed, it doesn't give me any troubles whatsoever. Like I don't, really don't have anything really bad to say about it. The only thing I can say to keep in mind either the wefts are single wefted, they're not double wefted. Um, what else? If you cut your wefts, they will shed, which is usually the case with any hair, anyways. And also, what else? Yeah, I have nothing else to say. Also, be careful if you want it to be um, curly hair. Maybe you should buy body wave hair. Like, this is just the hair to go if you want that slim, straight hair. So, that's my review so far. Um, I don't know if I'm going to come back with an update. I probably will in a couple of months if I feel like the hair has changed or anything. That's but my review. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to put all links in the description bar like I always do. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed to my channel already. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!